Ah, <sighs> finally. I didn't think we were gonna make it. No, but the traffic. I know Halloween brings out a lot of partiers, but like, come on, can't some people stay home and give out candy or something? Does everyone have to go out? Okay. Yeah, this is it. Come on, you know how it works. The most exclusive places have to be hard to find, but this should be it. I've been here a couple of times, but it's been a while. I mean, it's been a year, right? <laughs> I'm hoping it comes back to me. Wait, have you been here before? Okay then, first timer. Fresh meat. <laughs> I'm kidding. Come on, let's do the thing. Yep, password is Samhain. I mean, of course it is, right? I'm kind of surprised they couldn't be more original. But whatever, not my party. Okay then, this way to the fun. Hey listen, before we go in, thanks again for this. You know, for doing this as a first date. Well, most people want to go to a movie or dinner or something. A Halloween club thing is a bit... outside the usual. But I figured you'd be into it once we got going. Just a feeling, you know. Well, anyway, thanks for being adventurous with me. I promise it'll be a good time. Of course. I mean, I'm a fun date. Says so right on my profile. <laughs> I am, actually. You're a lot of fun. Or could you not tell from how much I was laughing on the way here? <laughs> You're cute. Come on, let's get in there. Oh, wow. I feel like we're late. So many people here already. Yep. You see anyone you recognize? Really? I'm surprised. Well, it's just such a small community, you know? Yeah, I figured everyone knew each other by now. Are you new in town or something? Huh, weird. You must be pretty introverted then. You know, I usually am too, but Halloween is just too much fun to stay in. I think we should get a drink. Yep, even though I'm not sure I can see the bar through this crowd. Hmm. Over here. I know this guy. I'm sure he'll spot us down here if we stay on the end. And there we go. Work like a charm. Hey Steve, happy Halloween. How's it going tonight? I know, right? It looks like twice the turnout as last year. Word gets around, I guess. Yeah, first timer. Be gentle. <laughs> Definitely. I'll have scotch on the rocks with a lime wedge. Ooh, single malt if you have it. Nice. That works. What do you want, sweetness? Um, is it okay if I call you that? Sorry, I should have asked. Cool. Drink? Awesome. Thank you, Steve. I hope we didn't jump too ahead of anyone. <laughs> you say the sweetest things. I don't believe a word of it, but it's nice of you to say. <laughs> Maybe another time. Perfect. Thanks, Steve. Good luck tonight. Don't get too buried under the throng. Here, let's find a corner and just observe for a bit. This works. Huh. <sighs> Oh, Steve. Yeah, he's a charmer. But definitely not my type. You know, I'm not sure, but it's not Steve. I know that much. I mean, I'm here with you, so maybe you're my type. You never know. Guess we'll see where the night takes us. Well, look who's here. Don't you two look delicious? Mm-hmm. It's always good to see you. Glad the year has been kind. You know, I love you girls to death, but if you look at my date like a snack, we're gonna have words. Mm-hmm. Behave. Maybe find easier prey. 
I know you love a challenge, but no. Yeah, that was Lily and Marta. Try not to let them corner you anywhere. Eh, they tend to get a little overzealous and handsy as hell once they have a few drinks in them. You doing okay so far? Having fun? Good. Let me know when you need another drink. Of course, you're nice enough to be here with me tonight. Drinks are the least I can do. Although I'd kill someone for a basket of pretzels right now. I wonder if there's food anywhere. I mean, it's a party. There should be food, right? Hmm. Maybe we'll take a lap in a bit and see what we find. How's that? Oh, and let me know if you want to dance. Of course. I'd love to dance with you. But maybe we finish our drinks first. Huh, <sighs> I like coming here. I'm still surprised you never have. Doesn't it get lonely, though? I mean, this isn't the only meetup of the year, but it's easily the biggest. I'm surprised you never wanted to be a part of it. Really? That's... Really weird. How could you not? Didn't anyone tell you? What the hell? Someone dropped the ball then. You definitely should have known. Like, a long time ago. Because you belong here. You feel that, right? You should. Yeah, the vibe. It's special. Only those of us in the community can feel it. Well, whatever. You're here now. Um... Can I say something else? You look really good. Yeah, you do. You're welcome. Shut up, you're a hottie, okay? Let me look at you in peace. <laughs> no, just... You know how it is sometimes. People don't always look the way their profile says they do. You are a pleasant surprise. Aw, oh, thanks. That's nice of you. Not gonna lie, I spent way too long picking out this outfit. Well, yeah, I had a good feeling about tonight. I wanted to look good. Yeah? Really? Wait, this jacket? It doesn't look that old. Well, then your granddad took good care of it. And it looks great on you. Good choice for tonight. Is he gonna want it back? Oh. I'm sorry for your loss. Okay, well, now that I've made it awkward... <laughs> I know, I'm sorry. I'm a little nervous. Just a little, and I'm working on it. Trying to be cool and chill and not... Awkward. Anyway... That really is a great jacket, though. Your granddad had good taste. Uh, my grandparents aren't with me anymore, but my folks are still alive. They live in Colorado. Yeah, I know. I probably should have stayed with them, but... I got tired of the same old hunting grounds, you know? I needed to branch out. Stretch my legs. Yeah? Glad I'm not the only one. You said you've lived here a while. Do you like it here? Me too. I think I've been more comfortable living here than anywhere else I've been. And now I've gotten to meet you, so that's nice, too. Mm-hmm. I'm the cutest. You should just understand that about me now. <laughs> I wonder how much longer. Until we can change. I'm getting a little antsy. I mean, I'm having fun, don't get me wrong, but... It'd be great to change and be more comfortable, you know? What? Um, no. You okay? Yeah, you look confused, which is weird. Probably won't be too much longer. They'll want to make sure everyone is here who's coming. And then, you know, lock the doors really tightly. Don't want anyone accidentally wandering in and getting an eyeful. Hmm? What? What the hell kind of question is that? What's the matter with you? You know this isn't that kind of place. Or you should know. Nothing inappropriate here. Geez, you think I'd bring you someplace like that on a first date? What do you take me for? Just stop playing dumb. It isn't funny. Hang on, it looks like... Yep, it's time. Good. 
Oh, oh man. It feels good to let my ears out. I was starting to get a headache holding them in. One sec. Let me get my tail. There. Ugh, oh, so much better. You okay? What is that face? Okay, maybe my ears are a tad bigger than you might have expected from my size, but you know what? It's genetic, okay? I think I look pretty good. What? Also, what are you waiting for? Go ahead and change. Um, into your better form? Like everyone else? Speaking of which... Oh, wow. Steve had his fangs done since last year. They look good. Kind of flashy, though. I guess that works for some people. Hey, look. I didn't recognize her before, but I would know those wings anywhere. I need to go say hi in a sec. I think the hair threw me off. Now the night can really get started. I think you'll enjoy it. Why do you look... Hey, what's wrong? Is this your first time in a group like this? You look really... I don't know, shocked? I get that you've been kind of sheltered, but not that sheltered. Don't worry, everyone here is nice. They'll accept you. Hey, you're gonna pass out breathing like that. Just... Wait. Wait. Are you... Oh, crap. I may have messed up. Um... Come on, come with me right now. Yep, this way, right now. Down through here. Yeah, well, it may be a little tight, but I think it's better than staying in a room full of extra naturals. Especially since you clearly aren't one. Of course it's real. Why wouldn't it be real? You saw it happen right in front of you. You're not stupid. Oh, please, I'm not hurting you. I'm not even touching you. Look, just breathe, okay? I clearly made a big mistake. Shh. Be still. You're safe here. Let me think. I'm a kitsune. It's a fox. You know what? Google it later. I'm thinking. So the profile and the text. You responded to every code word correctly. How did you do that if you weren't... The code words. Okay, you clearly don't know what I'm talking about. That's a really unfortunate coincidence. Oh, and your smell. How do you smell like werewolf if you're not... Hang on. Your granddad's jacket. Come here, let me sniff. Oh, stop it. If I wanted to hurt you, you'd be hurt already. Okay, yeah, you might want to talk to your grandma about your granddad. He was... not entirely human. Nope, and the jacket is what I've been smelling all night. Not you. Well, this is... awkward again. Uh, no. Not a joke, not a trick. And I have just made a really, really big mistake. Okay, well, yeah. Short version, extra naturals are a thing. Vampires, werewolves, kitanes, demons, yada yada. We stay on the down low, we blend in where we can, and we get together for the occasional party to blow off some steam and, you know, be normal for a night. I don't really care if you believe me, you literally saw people change in front of you. If that's not enough, well, go get your eyes checked tomorrow or something and tell yourself whatever you need to tell yourself to get through it. Sure, fine, whatever. You know what? This is not my fault. You gave every indication that you were a werewolf. Although, to be fair, the last werewolf I dated turned out to be a jerk, so maybe I should have learned my lesson. Hey, wait, you've got that about-to-vomit face again. Just take some breaths. I'm really sorry I brought you here tonight. I'm sorry I assumed... Well, it's kind of pointless now. But I really should get you out of here. If we go back in there, it'll be pretty obvious you're human. You'll be the only one not changed. Let's just say that a human at this sort of party doesn't tend to be a guest. They tend to be more... on the menu. Not me, you goober. I don't eat people. But you know, there are a few in there who... do. 
Okay, then. Let's find a back door and see if we can slip out. Um, come on, this way. Here, this looks promising. Hold up, this is locked. Maybe there's a way to... <laughs> I'm a fox, sweetness. I'm pretty clever. One sec. There we go. This should lead us out. Ah, success. Oh, crap, hang on. Let me... I know it's Halloween, but I don't want to walk around with my ears and tail out. There we go. Back to what passes for normal. You good? You're safe now. Hey, I know we barely know each other, so I just want to say, if you tell anyone what you saw tonight, they won't believe you. They'll think you're a nutcase. And if I find out you told anyway, let's just say there will be consequences. Okay? Good. Look, none of this has anything to do with you. I'm really sorry for the misunderstanding. You're a good person. I really liked hanging out with you. Thanks for... everything. Yeah, I'm just gonna go home. I think that's enough fun for the night. You drive safe, okay? Hmm? What does that mean? But... After what just happened... You sure? Because honestly, I don't know what to think about you right now. Other than you don't seem to be lying, so there's that. Um... Well, if you want, there's an ice cream shop on the next corner that has pretty good sundaes. Yeah, I guess we could give that a shot. Okay then, let's get some ice cream. Get to know each other a little better. Sure. Might as well have a good Halloween. Just... You know what, never mind. We'll figure it out. <laughs>